Hello, I'm Renee Seiler, an ambassador for Susan G. Komen for the Cure, and I'm someone who believes that we really all need to take responsibility for our breast health. Both my mother and father had breast cancer, and I was diagnosed with my own breast disease in 2003, resulting ultimately in a prophylactic mastectomy in 2007. Joining me now is Dr. Ann Moore. She's the medical director of the Breast Oncology Program at Weill Cornell Medical College. And she's here to talk about a rare and aggressive form of breast cancer, inflammatory breast cancer. Dr. Moore, thank you for joining us. Thank you, Renee. Can you tell us exactly what inflammatory breast cancer is? Because it seems we're hearing a lot about it lately. Well, inflammatory breast cancer is a rare form of cancer. It's only about one out of 100 of the new, newly diagnosed women will have it. It doesn't present as a lump or as an abnormal mammogram, but a woman will feel a, so a soreness, a redness, and some swelling in the breast. It looks like an infection of the breast, such as some women will get after nursing babies. And often the doctor will think that that's what it is and treat the patient with antibiotics. But when things don't get better after a week or two, then we become suspicious that this is inflammatory breast cancer. You mentioned swelling. Is the whole breast swollen or just that area? And, and is there pain associated with this? There may be some pain, some soreness. Uh, the whole breast may be swollen or just part of the breast. Is there a particular group that's more susceptible to this type of cancer? Young women? We see inflammatory breast cancer more in younger women, but we certainly can see it in older women also. Yeah. This, I, this is one of a couple of different types of breast cancer that, that we hear a lot about that are on the rare side. Paget's disease also. What is that? Paget's disease is sort of the, the other side of breast cancer. It's a very, very early form of breast cancer that just shows up in the ducts of the nipple and a woman will, will have a little rash around the nipple, and sometimes it actually gets better with cortisone, uh, but then it tends to come back. So any rash around the nipple uh, should be looked at by a, by a dermatologist. What, what is the treatment like for inflammatory breast cancer, and, and Paget's disease for that matter? Well, the treatments are very different. For Paget's disease, the treatment is surgery, uh, and that usually will cure uh, women with Paget's disease. With inflammatory breast cancer, we've learned that surgery alone is, uh, uh, is not, a, not enough treatment. But if we approach the, the patient with chemotherapy first, let the tumor shrink, then we can do surgery, then we do radiation therapy. Sometimes we follow with hormone therapy. And, and many women today with inflammatory breast cancer are cured of the disease. And, and the, the prognosis is good there in terms of recurrence or anything like that? If they have an excellent response to treatment, the prognosis nowadays is good. Thank you, Dr. Moore. For more information, you can visit the Susan G. Komen for the Cure website at www.komen.org, or you can call their helpline at 1-800-I'm-Aware. I'm Renee Seiler.